What is going on everyone out there in YouTube land today? We got something new on the table, something a little different. Today we're checking out an air purifier. Now, I have done a lot of videos on air purifiers because they come in really handy if you're a vapor or a smoker because they help clear the air in your home, um, prevents the vapor from building up on your electronics and your windows, and it also keeps the air clear because not everyone in your house may vape, so they do come in really, really handy. A majority of the ones that I have reviewed are much larger that cover, you know, larger homes, larger rooms, but what about the smaller ones? Uh, more of a personal one, maybe for your office, maybe for your desk, or maybe something that's going to be portable. Well, today we have an air purifier coming from Pura Vortex, or should we just say Pure Vortex? And this is the Mini. Model number on here is the AC201B. And I can pick these up on Amazon for $49, or you can go to the Pure Vortex website and save because they're selling them for $34. They currently have a, pr a promotion going on. No coupon code needed. $34. Head over, get one, because I said so. There's the box. You know, nothing really too fancy. Crack this open. All right, we got a uh, very simple user manual. I love the pictures. Because I'm not a fan of reading, so this comes in handy for people like me who don't really feel like reading the instructions. And then pop this sucker out. What else is in the box? Uh, nothing. That's it. Oh, we got a piece of foam. So get rid of that. Get rid of that. And this is a more detailed manual, I believe. We're not really too worried about that. What we're concerned about is what's inside of here, the air purifier. So let's unwrap this beauty. And let's see exactly just how big it is. Now, this is going to cover up to 215 square feet. It's got a 360 air intake, as you can see, kind of like the design. So the air is coming in from all around it, which is how I like it when it comes to sucking in the vapor. Um, my overpriced Dyson actually sucks and blows on the same side. So I don't think it's going to be as effective uh, if using it for stuff like, you know, getting rid of vapor and smoke and whatnot. Now, when you first get it, take the bottom off uh, because your power cord is going to be in there, which is really cool. So once again, if you're traveling with this thing, uh, you can just pack the power cord on the inside, not have to worry about it. But more importantly, you want to make sure you take the plastic off the filters. Do not turn this thing on with the plastic still on because uh, nothing will work. Beautiful filter on here. Not your typical cheap, just white old, you know, just regular generic filter. This is actually using a three-stage filter uh, with charcoal, charcoal filter, HEPA filter, and then your typical just standard, the pre-filter. Uh, the activated carbon filter and then the true HEPA filter. So it's three in one. You don't need to buy three separate filters. There's the power adapter. Pretty easy. Then drop the filter back in, and when you place the cap on, this might be kind of hard to see, but there's going to be two arrows. you got to line up those two arrows um, with each other, and then the cap will snap into place, and then you turn it, and then that locks because, since it is portable, we have this awesome little handle right here. So for some reason, if you want to carry it, or maybe you want to hang it on the wall for some reason, you can carry it by the handle. And you don't have to worry about the filter popping out because this bottom is locked. There's rubber feet on the bottom, so that way it's not going to slide across your tabletop. They kind of thought of everything. I believe it also comes in white, but in my opinion, this black one looks really, really sharp. Cool looking. So, got the adapter. Let's plug this in and let's see what it sounds like or hear what it sounds like. So the touch controls, they're not really kind of touch screenish. You've got to press them down. They do have a little bit of a clickiness to them, so they're not completely touch buttons. But we have the high-low settings, so low, medium, and high fan speed. We got the night light on and off. We got a few sleep timer settings, and then we have your power button there in the middle. Let's turn this thing on and see what it looks like or what it sounds like. I want to see what the light... Ooh, look at that light! That is awesome looking. Look how it lights up the inside. Tell me that is not cool. I was expecting some cheesy looking LED light that would barely light up, but this is really neat. 
how cool would it have been if this thing was like a color changing? But that's really neat. That's really nice. It is fairly bright, which is kind of nice for a, a, a dark room. But if you're not a fan, you can, like I said, you could turn this off simply by pressing the button. So we're currently on low, and I cannot even hear this thing really. The microphone is about uh, about a foot away, and just listen. Actually, my furnace that's on in the background is louder than this thing on low. Let's turn it out to medium. So it does pick up a little bit, but the 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 airflow is not super loud. It doesn't have that, that turbine engine sound to it because it's a smaller unit, smaller diameter. So it's more of a pleasant kind of breeze, if anything. Put it on high. Yeah, it just gets a little bit more intense, but it's still a nice calming, like really strong breeze. It doesn't sound like a helicopter is about to land in your living room. So I have these on my channel because a lot of vapors, these come in handy when you're vaping or if you're smoking. Because vapor, even though it's totally harmless, people that live in your house who don't vape may not want you to cloud up the entire room. Maybe the vapor builds up on your windows over time and it's a pain to clean them. Maybe your computer is uh, taking a crap on you because you've been blowing vapor at it for the past two years. Having something like this comes in very, very handy because it eliminates a lot of the vapor in the air. The smaller units are nice because you can place them on your desk and you can normally just blow right into them or at least blow the vapor in the direction. So what we're going to do is we're going to turn this on and then we're going to set it to, uh, we're doing high? We'll do high. You can actually feel the suction in along the sides right there. So it's a pretty powerful, powerful unit. Here we go. That really, really nice. Of course, it's not gonna get 100% of the vapor, but it'll get a good majority of the vapor so that way you don't end up clouding up the entire room or getting uh, that thick, film that you get on your windows so this is really doing a good job and remember folks it just doesn't do vapor and smoke it gets rid of pollen and dander and odors anything dust you name it because of that hepa filter on there it totally cleans the air in its small vicinity very very nice now, since vapor, I believe, is heavier than smoke, when you vape, the vapor usually drops. It doesn't go off into the air sometimes. So when I vape, and I blow above it, you can see the vapor kind of falls down, lands, it sucks it into it. And it's not going to get all of it, of course, but it gets, once again, a good majority of the vapor to help keep the room nice and clear and I mean, that's really all I can tell you. This is actually a nice little a little unit. I was a bit skeptical when I first got it. Thought it was going to be kind of cheap, especially for the price. Uh, I didn't think this thing was going to be all that great. But let me tell you, man, this thing is pretty powerful. I love that LED light. Can you turn it on when it's not working? No, you can't. Got to have it on. But fantastic unit, man. 34 bucks. If you guys are looking for something to help clear the vapor out of your room or maybe just something for the nightstand to kind of help you peacefully sleep at night with that nice beautiful smooth white noise check this out the pure vortex model number ac201b because they do have two of them you want to get the one that has the handle on it that's the newest version that's it hopefully you guys enjoyed the video if you want to see more videos like this let me know down in the comment section all links for this product and no vape products will be in the description. Check them out, and we'll see you on the next one, folks. Bye-bye.